This is part 4 of the series on HTML emails. In the previous videos, we have covered designing the email and setting up the HTML document. In this video, we'll take you through adding text to your email and styling the text so that it matches the design. Here we have the code for the email with the text included and styled. All the content is contained within the body tags. Note that we use a table and that each paragraph of text goes in its own table row. We never use divs or paragraph tags in HTML emails. Also note that all the CSS is inline. We never use CSS style sheets with HTML emails. Let's see how it looks in a browser. We have three paragraphs of text, then two columns with colored headings, and another two paragraphs for the email signature. Now let's look at the CSS styles. First note the style used for the whole table. We set the table width to 100% and also its max width to 600 pixels. This enables a responsive email. On big screens like laptops and desktops, the width of the email will be set to 600 pixels. But on smaller screens, such as smartphones, the email will adjust to fill 100% of the screen width. Now let's look at the styling of the text. We have set the font family, the font size, and the font color to match the text in our design. We have also added padding to the top and bottom of each cell to space each paragraph out. Note that we apply these styles to every TD in the table. For the columns of text, we have set the width of each table cell to 45% and used float left and float right respectively for the left and right columns. To create the headings, we have simply used a different color and a larger font size. We have added this code to the blog at simplelists.com so you can copy it and use it when creating your own email. In the next video, we'll cover adding images to your HTML email. Simple.